everybody, it's Schmickle123 here, and I'm going to teach you guys how to make stickers. Um, they're really fun, um, and really not a lot to do. Um, so we're, it's not a lot, it's not that hard. So, first off, you're going to need parchment paper, um, which is what you use for cookie sheets. You're going to need scissors, and of course you're going to need duct tape. I don't know what kind you want, um, I'm going to make a bunch with my friends, friends I should say, um, so anyways, let's get started. Um, you want to start off with the bigger things probably at first, so I'm just going to do a San Francisco 49ers one. Now normally if you're doing a really cool like design sketch or whatever that you drew and you want to do that, normally what you would do is you would sketch it onto here or like tr put it over your piece of paper and trace it, but anyways. We're not doing that. We're just using the actual patterns from the duct tape. So I'm going to take my sticker and I'm only going to use this part of it. Stick right over there. And I'm going to place it towards the corner so I can kind of get more room out of this part um, paper. And I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to cut it out. And why I say parchment paper for putting it on is because um, it peels off easily like a sticker back, which is really nice if you want to make a sticker, because um, they're nice little embellishments on your little notebook or whatever. Anyways, I cut it out, and see how easy that just fell off? Um, it's because it was loose. But anyways, now I have this little sticker with the parchment paper on the back, so it's not sticky at all. See? But all you have to do now is peel it, and you have your stickiness. So um, you can keep that like that and give it to gifts or something for your friends or whatever. But it's just like a little sticker, and they're super easy to make and super fun. Um, I'll take you guys through, I think, one more, and I'll do paw prints. Um, I'll do a heart of paw prints since I'm an animal lover. And depending on how big you want your heart, or my heart, I should say, because I'm going to make the heart. You guys don't have to make a heart, but it's just an example. Um, depending on how big it is, that's how much duct tape you want to use. Maybe you want to make it a huge heart and use two strips. I'm only going to use one because I'm not going to make it very big. So I'm going to get my parchment paper back. I'm going to go in my corner and I'm gonna stick it. You guys see that? Yeah. Okay. But as you can see, it falls off really easily, so you want to be careful using parchment paper. I'm probably using the wrong side, but it's okay. Okay. So, all I'm going to do is cut, um, cut the piece of paper with the tape. I'm just going to kind of make a V at first, because the parchment paper doesn't like sticking. Okay, there we go. So, I got this. Now, I got like this little triangle thing. <laughs> um, but anyways, I'm going to make this into a heart. I got it. I got it. No! Eh, it's not a very good heart, but it's okay. I like uneven hearts. But that's my little heart right there. It's like an uneven heart, but it's cute. Um, and again, it's like, it's not sticky until you remove the back. So, it's parchment paper's perfect. So, okay. If you guys like this and you want me to do more tutorials like this, just comment in the sections below. Please subscribe and I'll try to put some more videos out. Um, put some more videos out. Okay, see ya. Bye.